Hey friends, welcome back to my channel. For those of you who are new, my name is Steffi Drew and what better way to spend a gray, rainy, miserable day than to share some swimwear with you. I've been wanting to shoot this for pretty much all week, uh, but the weather is, so I'm in Toronto, Canada. We've been anticipating spring for a while and definitely waiting for summer, but it feels like this like dreary kind of wintry cold has just kind of like crept its way into spring. Plus we're all stuck inside. So like, I just haven't been in the mood for swimwear, but I want to be in the mood for swimwear. So today's the day. I am sharing a mini ASOS swimwear haul with you guys today. So I first checked out ASOS because they carry a tall range. After I was looking at their tall stuff, I found out that they also carry like fuller bust swimwear and lingerie. As all of you know, I, I'm very tall, so anytime there's um, a line that has tall clothing, I, I like to check them out and see, are they actually tall friendly? Are they going to fit the six foot plus uh, tall glamazons? But I was super stoked when they when I found out that they also carry fuller bust swimwear and lingerie because I am tall and, and slim, but I am on the bustier side. Now I did buy, um, I only, I don't have like, this is, this is a mini haul. I have three swimsuits and then I also have one bralette. I didn't actually look to see what like the whole size range of swimsuits are on ASOS, but in the fuller bust section, they do have a huge range. There are so many cute options, which I didn't really realize were a thing because I felt like the bigger the cups, the uglier the bra, which in a lot of, like at a lot of places, you sacrifice style when you are going up in size. Um, but that is not the case on ASOS. I didn't want to like jump all in not knowing really my size on ASOS um, and also not knowing how they would fit or if the quality was even that great. So I did raid the sales section. Um, I will, if there's, I don't even know if they're still gonna be available, but I'll make sure to link everything that I got down below. That way you can see what it is, what the current sale price is, if it's still available. But yeah, so I did get these all on sale. They may not all be available. But without further ado, let's check these ones out. I'll, I'll show you guys what they look like. I'll tell you what I think. And hopefully this swimsuit energy will bring some sunshine because I could really use some right now. So the first one is this swimsuit top. This is the one that wasn't available in the size that I wanted. So I got a size US 30G slash H. Typically I at least for this haul, what I was looking for was a 32G. Just to see how things go. Um, I know that 30 is on the tighter side, but I couldn't resist. I feel like the on the model, this just looked like such like a, a good kind of sporty fit, something that's gonna hold you in. So if you wanna be active. When I'm on vacation, I like to play beach volleyball and I don't have very many bathing suits that I feel like really hold me in and is safe for me to play beach volleyball. Um, but I do feel like this kind of top would be something that I could do that in. So I'm going to pair that with my existing black bottoms uh, and we're gonna try this on and I'll tell you what I think. This is what the tiger print looks like. Show you back. Now I'm just wearing these with my existing black uh, Victoria's Secret. They've got like scrunch bum, um, but they didn't have uh, any of the matching bottoms in stock, unfortunately. But I just loved how the fit of this looked. I love how the print of it looked. And like I said, I did get this one in a 30 waistband. The stretch on it is comfortable enough that I don't feel like it's too tight, but it is snug. Like as you can, like the girls are like in there, like we're being like kept in. So yeah, this would definitely be something that you would find me wearing if I'm planning on playing like outdoor sports, like beach volleyball or water volleyball or whatever I'm doing. This is something that's gonna keep me in. Um, it's It kind of feels like a sports bra, the way that it fits. But I feel, I love this shape when it comes to a bikini because I feel it's simple, it's comfortable, um, and it just, it just looks, 
it just looks good. If I were to get this anywhere else, I feel like there wouldn't be enough fabric to actually properly cover everything. So the fact that like I'm not spilling out into my armpits and like it's a little bit spilling out front, but I think that's also because I did get a 30. Uh, if I got a 32, it would give a little bit more space. If you have fuller breasts, this gets my thumbs up as well. And I'm in love with this. I would almost even wear this like, I feel like this with like high-waisted pants and like a blazer. Oh, not that I'd wear a bathing suit under a blazer. Who would do that, crazy? Should have sorted this out. This one, I kind of forgot what it looked like. I remembered that I got something in this like orangey red like a poppy red someone is like sawing outside I don't know if you guys can hear that I forgot what the photo looked like when it arrived so when I first put it on I was very confused because it, it, it I, I don't know what I did but it wasn't kind of fitting properly but I got this in a size 32 G as well it has like the cups and then like this draping piece over it but when I try it on you'll see this kind of like comes up in front and then it's just got like nice simple straight straps in the back it has this little plastic closure so getting your proper band size uh, is important because it doesn't have like a tie closure oh also all the bottoms for reference I get a size 6 I'm a pretty standard size 6 can't really well you can tell that this is not gonna cover my whole butt uh, but the side kind of matches the twist in the front which you will see when I try it on it's got that like twist on the side anyway I'll we'll try these on and I'll show you what I'm talking about so here's the red suit first of all fit is perfect it fits my band size fits perfectly it's not riding up obviously it has so the straps are adjustable on the back the size on this is perfect so the cup size here I didn't mention so right on the inside there's that kind of like rubbery lining that you get with like a strapless bra just to keep it from like like falling down and kind of keep you up. So that is included even though it does have straps and it's it comes up around your neck and it's supported. That extra little bit of support on the cups um, is actually really nice. So I, I love the design of this. I think it's very elegant. It's something that I feel like I would want to wear this to like... I feel like I'd want to wear this to like a Vegas pool party, which we're not doing right now. <sighs> I miss Vegas. Yeah, I, I'm in love with the color. I love the style for the bottom. So like I said, this kind of like twisted, this like twisted detail is mimicked on the side. So it's very simple. It's not like full coverage. It is a little bit cheeky, um, but it's not like ramp right up your butt, like not thong style so it's very comfortable fits perfectly a plus on choosing the right size um yeah i absolutely absolutely love this suit okay the next one that we're gonna try on uh that i'm gonna share with you guys is i got a white set so first of all here's the top and it has this like mesh kind of cover and strap um one of these like plastic clasps in the back and i got this one in what size did i buy this in this one i did get in a 32g a us size 32g so this is the top and it comes with high-waisted bottoms that i thought were really cute um with the same kind of matching mesh on top now I, my favorite bikini bottoms are generally like a high-waisted, more of like Brazilian style, just because I hate tan lines. That being said, I do like to have options because sometimes there's certain people that you don't want your whole butt hanging out with. So this one is kind of not like a full coverage bottom, uh, but I'll show you when we try it on. It's kind of like a half coverage, uh, a little bit more modest, but super cute. And this is how the white suit fits. Again, A plus and choosing the right size. The cup size fits perfectly. Band size fits perfectly. That's the back. That's the front. I didn't really realize when I was buying these swimsuits that I essentially bought 
So the red and the white suit are essentially the same concept, just with slightly different styles. So just like the red suit, it's got the cups here, strapless kind of concept with the same kind of um, rubber lining just to help keep it on and keep it from moving. And then the straps are this like overlay on top. So yeah, this one also fits perfectly. I love the style. This one's kind of bridal almost. Um, so at some point when I have a getaway wedding, oh! <laughs> and then the high-waisted bottoms. Now, if I can go back to show you enough. These are not my favorite style. That being said, I don't dislike them. I just generally don't like when I feel like the bathing suit kind of like cuts cuts into my bum. When I'm wearing it on its own, I have no problem with it, but if I were to put shorts or something over top and you can see that underwear line, I hate underwear lines, so I wouldn't love that, but it wouldn't deter me from wearing this, if that makes sense. Don't love the cut, but I still like this as a whole, so. I still love it I and I'm so stoked that it actually fits me it's been a long time since I've tried two bathing suits like or any uh, any ba amount of bathing suits in a row that have all actually fit me what? this is crazy and finally now this isn't swimwear but I did want to try a bralette as well because they have so many lingerie options I would love to do like a separate lingerie haul uh, but I, I did this all at once because it is my first time purchasing from their fuller bust kind of section. Uh, so I did add a bralette as well. So this one, uh, so all those bathing suits that I got were ASOS, uh, from like the ASOS swim brand, I guess. So this bralette is from, uh, the brand is Rougette by Tutti Rouge. Tutti Rouge? Tutti Rouge. Uh, and it says Rougette, and on the back of the tag it says the Fuller Bust Company. Uh, designed in England just for you with love from the Fuller Bust Company. I saw this, I thought it was really cute, something that I could wear kind of like an everyday um, bralette but still pretty kind of lacy, that kind of feel. So this is the front. Now it is a sheer bralette so I'm going to have to be strategic when I try it on. This is the front and then it's got one, two, three, four, five um, little bra clasps on the back. So lots of support in the band. And it's got like a nice kind of thick band on the back. And then also, which I didn't really realize when I bought it, but the back of it, so it's got the double here, the little um, whatever clasp here uh, that you tighten it with, it's a heart. Like this is so cute. I have a couple things to talk about. Actually, I'll, I'll talk about them now before I try it on. On the inside of the cup of this bralette, there's like this extra half panel of mesh. This half panel of mesh doesn't really kind of fill it out quite the same. And when I tried it on, at first I was like, what is going on here? When I tried it on, I understand why it's there because, because it's not like a super structured bralette this mesh panel on the side does provide kind of like structure on the side and there is underwire but almost like a little like lift so it keeps you kind of together and like forward and up a little bit but i feel like and i'll i'll try it on like i'll show you best i can when i try it on i feel like because my boobs are natural they're squishy, they move around a lot. And having a half panel like that, I just like, it keeps my boob in, but then like as soon as the edge of that half panel like ends, my boob spills out the side. So I don't know if that's a sizing issue with this one. I got this bralette in a uh, US 32H. So I don't know if that's a sizing issue, if I should have gone smaller or bigger, I don't know. Um, but I have an idea of how to fix it and I don't know if that 
I might just take that out. But I'll show you when I try it on, um, kind of how it looks, and then we might just cut it out and see if that helps. Anyways, let's try this on. And finally, this is how the bralette fits. Now, I have to, actually maybe if I go down here. Okay, so this bralette is sheer, so for obvious reasons I have to make sure I am covered uh, and can't entirely show you. Um, so I'm going to, before I move, okay. So, as you can, you can kind of see that mesh part here. And it's really hard to, oh, maybe if I show you from this side, you can see that it's like holding me in till about here, but then my boob kind of like spills out and it's creating this like weird double bump, which if I were to wear this under like a t-shirt or something, that would be so obvious. That being said, the material is really nice. The entire fit of the bralette feels so nice. It's just the profile that it's giving me with that little mesh insert. It's just so weird. Um, there's definitely a little bit of room when it comes to the actual cup and I think part of that is because of that little mesh insert. Now, that being said, if you had enhanced boobs and they obviously are going to be a little bit more firm, I feel like something like that when you're wearing a bralette like it's not going to do the same thing. It's just if you have a natural breast that is a, it's it does it does what it wants. So at first I was like, do I return it? Like I got it on sale, so it wasn't even it was it was not that expensive. So I am going to try cutting it out because the rest of this bralette fits and looks so. It looks so cute and it fits really well. So I'm gonna see if it fits any better if I cut that out. I'm back and can confirm, I think I just solved my problem with those little mesh inserts. I cut them out. The material, by the way, is really nice. Like the little mesh insert, so soft, so nice. Like these, are, this is so well made. Um, but yeah, I will back up. <clears throat> it's hard to really show you the silhouette this silhouette right here is so much nicer without that mesh insert. I don't mind if my boobs sit a little bit more of a natural shape. Um, this, it just made this bra so comfortable and I'm going to wear it for the rest of the day now. The size without those little mesh inserts also is perfect. I'm not like bubbling over anywhere. I'm literally sitting perfectly into this bralette. And that is it, that is all. Um, like I said, this is just a mini haul. Um, I didn't go crazy because I wasn't entirely sure how everything would fit, if I was even ordering my proper size, um, and if I would like them. So, final thoughts, I'm actually very, very pleased with how this order went. I feel like, for the most part, I, I am the, like I did order the correct size and I will be purchasing again. This video was not sponsored in any way. I bought these on my own accord. All of my views and thoughts are honest. I mean, if they want to send me more to review, I'm not saying no, but yeah, no. I, def I definitely will be purchasing more from them though. I do, I love how many options they have. I love how many options they have in a variety of sizes. 10 out of 10 would recommend, at least I would recommend these. I know this video was a little bit different. I'm not necessarily shopping tall, but I'm shopping for another body uh, obstacle, I guess you could call it, uh, when I am shopping. So. I hope this helped. If you have any questions uh, or comments, please leave them down below. I love to hear from you. And if you like this video, you found it helpful, hit that like button. And if you are new then and you haven't subscribed yet, then please join the Drew Crew and hit the subscribe button down below. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this one. Now I just need some sunshine and uh, the okay to leave my house and go somewhere warmer so I can actually wear these 
You know what, actually, I would just be happy being able to wear these on my patio, but mother nature doesn't seem to agree. That is all for today. I hope you enjoyed it and I will see you guys in the next one. Bye.